the 2023 New Balance Indoor Grand Prix lived up to expectations as the athletes were able to give fans world-class performances both on the field and on the track. With the likes of American superstars such as men's 60m hurdles world record holder Grant Holloway, women's 400m hurdles world record holder Sydney McLaughlin Leverney, and world championship gold medalist in the women's pole vault Katie Moon, the meet brought joy to fans as they cheered on their favorite athletes. Who has been struggling with a bit of a hamstring injury and was a late withdrawal. So to Jaswin Shankar of India, the Commonwealth bronze medalist. The meet began with the men's high jump, which saw Bahamian Donald Thomas being the only Caribbean man competing in the event. Thomas was able to achieve his best clearance of 2.23 meters with only one attempt to play second behind India's Tejaswin Shankar, who won the event with a clearance of 2.26 meters, while Daryl Sullivan of the United States finished third with a season's best clearance of 2.19 meters. The next event was the richly anticipated women's 60 meters heats, which featured America's Sydney McLaughlin Levroni and the fastest woman alive in the 200 meters, Sharika Jackson of Jamaica, along with her training partner, Bahamian Antonique Strachan. The heats saw neither McLaughlin Levroni nor Jackson advancing, as they ran times of 7.33 seconds and 7.34 seconds, respectively. Antonique Strachan was the lone Caribbean woman to advance to the final. Well, they go Hobbs and Briscoe pretty even off the start line, but now Hobbs gets the edge. Briscoe chasing it down at the moment, but it's going to be Aaliyah Hobbs once again. In the final, America's Aaliyah Hobbs was able to continue her undefeated season in the 60 meters by winning in a meeting record time of 7.02 seconds, while her countrywomen Mikia Briscoe and Celera Barnes were able to finish second and third respectively with times of 7.10 seconds and 7.21 seconds. Antonique Strachan finished 8th with 7.40 seconds. 2018 World Under-20 Championship 110m Hurdles Gold Medalist Jamaica's Damian Thomas competed in the heats of the 60m Hurdles and finished 4th with a time of 7.82 seconds. But he was unable to qualify for the final which had all 8 Americans advancing. In the final, the world record holder Grant Holloway ran a world-leading 7.38 seconds to win while his countrymen Daniel Roberts and Freddie Crittenden were second and third respectively with times of 7.46 seconds and 7.55 seconds. In the women's 500 meters, World Championship's 400 meters hurdle silver medalist Femke Ball was able to run a world best of 1 minute 5.63 seconds to break the previous 1 minute 6.31 seconds world best held by Olesya Forsheva of Russia. Jamaica's Leah Anderson was able to run a national record of 1 minute 8.34 seconds, while her countrywoman Geneve Russell was third in 1 minute 9.18 seconds. We've seen a good amount of Noah Lars working on the first 60 meters of his race and coming through as he always does in the second half of the race. The men's 60 meters heats featured two Caribbean men, Puerto Rico's Miles Lewis and Michael Campbell of Jamaica, as both were able to advance to the final with times of 6.69 seconds and 6.73 seconds, respectively. The final was won by double 200 meters world champion Noah Lyles of the United States in a close finish with his countryman Trayvon Brommel, with both of them being credited with the same time of 6.51 seconds. Ghana's Benjamin Azamati was third in 6.62 seconds, while Miles Lewis was fourth in the same time and Michael Campbell was eighth in 6.79 seconds. Double 200 meters Commonwealth Games champion Jareem Richards of Trinidad and Tobago was second in a very close 400 meters, as he and Noah Williams of the United States both ran the same time of 45.88 seconds, with Williams given the win. Jamaica's Javon Francis was fifth in 47.61 seconds. Adele Tracy of Jamaica was able to run the 3,000 meters and finished ninth in 8 minutes, 52.96 seconds. The meet ended with the women's 60 meters hurdles, which saw the only Caribbean win of the day, as Devine Charlton of the Bahamas ran a season's best of 7.87 seconds to win. Sharika Nelvis of the United States was second in 7.93 seconds, and Celeste Mucci of Australia was third in 7.95 seconds. 2015 World 100 meters hurdles champion Jamaica's Danielle Williams was fourth in 7.97 seconds. The World Indoor Tour continues next weekend with more Caribbean athletes on show at the 115th Milrose Games, Saturday, February 11th. Please like, subscribe, 
share our channel with others, and turn on the notification bell for our next video as we explore the Caribbean together. This is Jire Caribbean. Thanks for watching.